The WWE Universe with an electric feeling here tonight. We are sold out and raring to go. I am amped up, pumped up, jacked up, and ready to kick things off. What are we waiting for, fellas? Let's watch some fights. Enough of the... We've been waiting a long time. No nonsense, no gimmicks, no flips, just fists. Two men who proudly carry collective chips on their shoulders, and they've managed to use that, that bitterness to bring themselves to the big stage where it's their time to shine. It's a hostile take. Two men who have transformed sports entertainment as we know it. Let me guess, Byron. You were one of those kids that came to see a WCW. Well, sometimes. Yeah, I was all about the NWO. One more for the good guys. Hey, you think Scott Hall will give us a survey tonight? Multi-time tag team champions, one of the great factions in sports entertainment history. Change the game. Rash, bold, and not afraid to offend anyone. about going anywhere. What a way to start off a tag team match. Big, sexy Kevin Nash locking up here. If you haven't hit record yet, now might be a good time to do that. Oh, These guys are going to have a match you'll want to watch over and over again. you got to believe this one's over. What a stop. Good grief.
through the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Big time impact from way up high. On the mark. Looks like Kevin Ash is starting to stumble. And at this point, you have to wonder if he can recover from this. He needs a breather in a bad way right now. If he could oh, just man. make it to his corner and make the tag. A tale of two different superstars in this match right now. One looks like he can take on the world, while the other looks completely battered. Boom, what impact! As we say in the trade, guys, the monitor area in the locker room is likely sold out for this one, as there are plenty of superstars with a vested interest in the outcome of this match. title opportunity. However, a lot of that, of course, depends on the outcome of this match here tonight. And with that in mind, regardless of their personal feelings, you'd have to think the locker room is rooting for the champion here tonight. The last thing they want to do is to have to wait even longer while the champ's rematch clause kicks in. Oh, come on! How can this be legal? This could lead to a disqualification quick. I can tell you guys that this arena sold out in record time, and a lot of that has to do with this match in the ring right now. This is easily one of the most anticipated title matches in recent memory. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Dash Wilder. saying, Michael, when news broke that this title match would take place here, I had dozens of people I know in and around the area calling and texting, just hoping I could get them tickets. That's how big this match is. It's a fetch. Boom! Dawson takes out the knee. Uh-oh. This could be the turning point, Cole. How is Hall going to remain alive? Oh, man. Right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Looks like Scott Hall is fading here. If they want to win this match, he really needs to make a tag soon. You know, I thought this match was going to be much more tightly contested. I guess that's not the case, though. Boom! Victory is on the horizon. He's going for the pin. And he stops the count. Lucky him. Inverted suplex. Wilder is fired up. Shoulders down. 
down. Is it enough? And he breaks up the pinfall. Let's keep fighting. Scott Hall's on the wrong side of this thing. If he's not careful, this match is going to be over. Hooked up. Ah, oh, shit breaker. The challenger's championship dreams are fading quickly. This is not where he wants to be at this point in this tag team match. If he could just make it to his corner, these guys still have a chance. But if not, I don't see how he can overcome all this punishment and win. Wilder usually has help, but he's going to have to fight night! Looks like the end of the He goes for the cover. And that's it. This one is over. These guys feel no love for each other. Here's another look. This was another great moment. I remember this part very well. Man, this was great. And last but not least, Team. It's performances like the one we just saw from these guys that makes tag team wrestling so exciting. What a way to kick off tonight. Don't go anywhere, folks. We're just getting started. We'll see if the next match lives up to the hype of the first. Sit the wait is over. This one's for all the marbles, and it's coming up next. We have one of our breakout talents taking on some tough competition. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Cruiserweight Championship. They're on their feet for Johnny Wrestling. soul to find who this young man is. What's it about Johnny Gargano that makes him as good as he is today? Unparalleled heart. Johnny Gargano has been through it all in his career before arriving in WWE, and now that he's here, it's a dream come true. Johnny will not let his dream slip through his fingers. The soul of WWE's cruiserweight division. Oh. 
Guys, Cedric Alexander had one of the best matches in the Cruiserweight Classic a couple of years ago. It, it was so good, Triple H came out and applauded the man and then signed him to a WWE contract. Cedric's a true testament to hard work and chasing your dreams and never saying die. Cedric has a bright future here in WWE. Uh, Cedric Alexander dropped 20 pounds just to be part of the Cruiserweight Classic. Introducing the challenger from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 199 pounds, Johnny Gargano. Introducing the champion from Charlotte, North Carolina, weighing in at 200 pounds, he is the WWE Cruiserweight Champion, Cedric Alexander. Don't even think about going anywhere. The hard-hitting Cedric Alexander has had one singular focus upon his WWE arrival. Kick to cause pain. And I can't help but get the feeling that this is going to be one of those matches people will be talking about for a long time to come. Hey, Corey, when's the last time you checked your lumbar? I don't know what you're trying to get at, Saxton. Man. I don't consent to a lumbar check from Cedric Alexander. I've got my own chiropractor. Thank you very much. That could be it. Two. Call me crazy, but this might be one of those rare instances where the champion actually enters the match as the underdog. I know it sounds odd, but it really seems like the champ is up against a headwind here. He wants no part of the outside. You're not crazy, Byron. The champ certainly has an uphill battle here. And while it's rare, we have seen the challenger head into the match as the heavy favorite. Bruno San Martino challenging Stan Stasiak in 1973 immediately comes to mind, as does Diesel squaring off against Bob Backlund in 1994. Boy, did you really just say that Saxton is not crazy, Cole? Man, just when I started to think you might be all right, you go and say something ridiculous like that. Crashing down the hard way. Obviously a great opportunity here for the challenger who can't afford to make any mistakes here tonight. Not when you're in the ring with a champion as dominant as this one. Now the champion into the cover. He's got him covered. He's a long way from a three count, I can tell you that. Gonna take more than that. A big first right into the buckle. To follow up Byron's earlier point, the challenger has to remember just how rare championship opportunities truly are here in WWE. A loss here could result in a trip to the back of the line. Don't worry, Cole. This isn't the challenger's first rodeo. Everybody knows exactly what's at stake here. Beautiful technique. The champ's starting to sweat. He's a true champion. I suspect he has plenty of fight left in him. Yeah, but it looks to me like he still has plenty of energy in that body of his. I wouldn't look too much into this right now. Guys, these superstars really do appear to be in peak physical condition here tonight, which isn't surprising considering what's on the line here in this championship match.
I gotta agree with you, Michael. These superstars are in tremendous shape, and from what I understand, the champ has been hitting the gym twice daily in preparation for tonight. I heard the same thing, Saxton. Once in the morning, then again at night after the show, which makes me wonder when the champ actually sleeps, if at all. Boom, what impact! He's got the shoulders down. Easily kicks out of that one. Not yet. Oh, boy, he is rolling. This might be it. Oh, my. We've seen champions head into matches maybe a little too confident, only to be picked. Alexander's looking to end it. Springboard clothesline by Alexander. That could be a game changer. That changes everything. Oh boy, he is rolling. Taking out the arm, great strategy. The challenger not in a great place. The champ. The champion into the cover. Speaking of champions heading into matches a bit overconfident, one of the most glaring examples of that would have to be the honky tonk man's attitude. Heading into his Intercontinental Championship. Cedric Alexander looking to take the lumbar check. Now he's got to capitalize. Look at this. Not enough to end this one. Not yet. Folks, we're coming to you live from Minneapolis, which of course was the home of the AWA for so many decades. What a stomp! Good grief! Knee drop! That was nasty. So precise. His shoulders are down. I'm not sure if the referee didn't blow that call. Well, that's another example of Johnny Gargano always having his opponent well scouted. Oh. <laughs> Johnny Gargano looks like he's really struggling under this pressure. Oh, he's as good as finished. I wouldn't be surprised if he just passes out right here. What a frog splash. He goes for the cover. I don't know too many other guys that would have been able to kick out of that. How'd he do that? The champ on the defensive now. I'd say he's starting to feel the pressure a bit. That confidence he had in his face at the start of this match sure has disappeared, and with good reason. He's taken quite a beating. Hooked him up. When this guy's on, look out. Man, what a slam. Put me into the cover with the title on the line. New champion, new champion. He's got some fight left in him. Cedric, ooh, what impact. But he's got to capitalize now. Cross face applied. To think, I almost rode him off of here. No, he breaks out of it. But does he have enough energy left to get back on the offensive? Driver, the champ being pushed to the break. He may very well be on Dream Street right now, guys. Cedric needs to find that willpower he's known for. That's the way they drew it up. He's making a beautiful technique. I'm not sure how much he has left. Oh, man, Cedric Alexander really needs to dig down deep. Oh, long dart to the turnbuckle. Wow, what a gritty performance. Quickly into the cover with the title on the line. Three. Johnny Gargano did it. Gargano. Now let's look back at that amazing action.
Highlight for one superstar, low light for another. Almost forgot about this one. Man, oh man, look at that. And here's the last piece of the puzzle. Here is your winner and the new WWE Cruiserweight Champion, Johnny Gargano. You heard the ring announcer, this one's over. And here's your winner. I could watch them go at it each and every week. What a match. And folks, as a reminder, the action tonight is coming to you from one of the greatest wrestling hotbeds of all time, Minneapolis. Well, the last match did not disappoint, and now we're on to the next matchup on the card. Get ready for some double... The wait is over. This one's for all the marbles, and it's coming up next. The Irish last kicker. Introducing the challenger from Dublin, Ireland, Becky Lynch. Go ahead, Byron. Get head over heels. Tell us all why Becky Lynch is so great. A young lady who has prided herself on being different. A young lady who has prided herself on thinking outside the box. And she has taken that mentality to tremendous success here in WWE. Becky Lynch should be prosecuted for improper use of the metal horns out here dressed like something out of an H.G. Wells novel. Introducing the challenger from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, Akane Brett. Guys, the upcoming triple threat match should be nothing short of spectacular. Yeah, especially considering what a victory could do for the career of the superstar who walks out of here with the win.
And introducing the champion from West Newberry, Massachusetts. She is the WWE Women's Champion, Rachel Rivers. Ladies and gentlemen, the atmosphere inside this arena right now is absolutely unreal. This crowd cannot wait to get to this triple threat match. And they haven't sat down yet, Michael. I'm willing to bet they'll be on their feet the entire match. Here we go, folks. Ooh. Triple threat action underway here. The unpredictability of a triple threat match wow. makes this almost impossible to predict. Any one of these three could walk out of here the winner. Now the arm's trapped. Big time slam. Vicious. Oh, nasty impact. Beautiful side Russian leg sweep. Ooh. What's this? What a driver. What a stomp. Good grief. They're starting to falter. There's so much on the line for her here tonight. Not surprising, Cole. When you're in the ring with two of the best women on the roster, you're going to take a few lumps. That's just the way it is. Yeah, but I feel pretty confident in saying that she still has plenty of gas left in the tank. Snapmare takeover. Ooh. Ooh, nasty. I know anything is possible, but I just can't envision a new champ being crowned here tonight. The champ just comes into tonight with too much momentum. Hard landing there. Nothing to worry about. Just a little misstep on her part. She's out of it, guys. Yeah, she's leaving herself wide open here. Byron, I agree that the champ comes into tonight with a great deal of momentum, but like you said, anything can happen. We've seen champs get upset in the past. Jeez. Who's to say it can't happen again here tonight? Agreed. I don't think anybody expected Eddie Guerrero to defeat Brock Lesnar for the WWE Championship back in 2004, but hey, it happened. And it's further proof that any superstar can beat any other superstar on any given night. A big fight feel inside this arena here tonight for this huge championship match. And so far, I'd say these competitors have brought their A games. You're absolutely right, Michael. This arena is electric right now. And I think part of it is their desire to be part of history. I think they're all anticipating a title change here tonight. Cool your jets, Saxton. Let's not go crowning a new champion just yet. There's still plenty of match to go here. Mention of good driver. Oh. Absolutely planted. Looks like she wants to beat her inside the ring. With a point of the elbow right in the nose. Jeez. She goes for the cover. Didn't have to dig very deep to kick out of that. Not yet. She's calling her out. Caught him. Uh-oh. Oh, got him up. Got him up. Is it enough to put Becky away? She goes for the cover. 
And now that one's countered. Wow, that was impressive, Michael. There it is. A concerned look on the face of the champ. A lot of people are saying the champion has never looked better, but that clothesline! Is it enough? Targeting the chest, very effective. Is it enough to put Becky away? Oh man, she is rolling now. She goes for the cover. Kicks out in time. I'm just as shocked as everyone else, Cole. Look at her go. She got her with a reversal. She shows signs of life. She's showing a lot more than that. As Byron was talking earlier about the champ being a heavy favor here tonight, I couldn't help but think back to the night Santino Morello defeated Amaga for the Intercontinental Championship in 2007. I don't think there was a person alive who thought Santino had even a slip. Looking at it here. Harsh impact. This match might be over, guys. And she breaks free. I don't know how she did it, but that was impressive. Oh, nasty. She's in control. She goes for the cover. Kicks out in the nick of time. She just will not give up, Cole. She's got her. Becky Lynch just too fast for her. She's in full control now. Here she goes, back in the ring now. I think she's trying to prove a point here. Nailed it. Oh, what a shot. Yeah, she doesn't want to take too many more of those. I think we know what this is. The champ starting to feel the pressure a bit. Her opponent clearly has her number here. Remember, guys, she's been in control for much of this match. It's going to take a lot more than big slam. Wow, what a move. Buster. She goes for the cover. And the champ kicks out. She's not done yet. That's how you wear down your opponent. Oh my goodness, this hurts. Uh-oh. Uh Inside the ring now. She's almost out of it. No, she escapes it. Yeah, I don't know if she had it locked in fully, Michael. No, she's too quick for her. She is on fire. Penny predicament. There it is. The exploder. That's it. That's what she needed. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. New champion. Barely in two. In the world, when she gets in attack mode, look out. Becky Lynch is looking for the ending. Cross. Going through. Oh, they got, got the arm, got the arm. And now, one more time. What a scary drop. The champ's in a bad way now, Cole. Okay, this time has to do it. Uh-oh. She better do something fast. She works her way out of that one. She's still got a bit of an uphill climb here, though. Nice. Boom! <laughs> Ooh. Oh, using the knee as a weapon. And that one does the job. It definitely dropped her, but I'm not so sure it's over yet. We're looking at complete domination here. Here's the pin title. been surprised if that was it. Wow. With all the damage done, you have to wonder how much more it'll take. Back in from the apron. Ooh, what impact. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. 
line. Two. The resolve this woman is showing right now is absolutely unreal. I gotta tell you, I thought she was done there. And there's the breakup. Just in the nick of time. Flying forearm. Oof. Here's the pin. Title on the line. Two. And the champ kicks out. Somehow she's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. She's going to get her to tap here. Quickly into the cover with the title on the line. The champion. You can't teach the type of tenacity we're witnessing here. Unreal. I can't believe what we're seeing here. This might be it. Oh, my. Oh, and she's dropped there. Yeah, she might be done here, guys. Trip to the local medical facility might be in order after that. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Well, she's got a tremendous amount of resilience, so I think she's got some something left here. I can't believe she kicked out there. Uh-oh. Becky Lynch may have it. And Corey, she releases the hold. Looks like a questionable decision on paper, but I'm sure she has something up her sleeve here, Cole. Look at her go. Yeah, I love the effort here, but she'd better hope she can sustain it. Those three superstars laid it all on the line, as we can see right here in these clips. Who could forget this? She's taking care of business. That's a woman on a mission. And that's exactly how she wanted to end this thing. Nice job turning back both competitors here tonight. I'm ready to see these three go at it again. Who's got the rematch contract? Get out here. Let's get this done. And folks, as a reminder, the action tonight is coming to you from one of the greatest wrestling hotbeds of all time, Minneapolis, Minnesota.